Hi, I'm Nish. And I'm Dee. Welcome back to the channel. Today we are watching Vox Machina, episode 8, season 3. Let's get into it. I want to find out what happened to Yeah, what so happened really to Percy? Sad. Do we really think that he's dead? I don't want to say TBD. Anything. TBD. If you haven't already, don't forget to like and subscribe. Check out our Patreon, the link in description below if you want to get the full uncut version of the episode. Let's get into the episode. Let's get it. Siege and silence. Another backstory? Yeah. Maybe a Kaylee backstory. What are you oh, it's Grog. Oh. Oh, Grog backstory. I don't think it's a backstory. I think they're just moving oh, forward. Yeah. <laughs> oh, but Scanlon's there already. But he has no beard. Oh, you're right. This is... <gasps> it's going to be Percy. Psst, you there. Happen to be some sort of cultist? I beg your oh, mind. when they first found Percy. If we break hmm. you out, how much would it be worth? A small fortune, I dare say. Oh, he's our last member to join. I'm totally alone in the world. Uh -huh. Perhaps you can relate. Turns out, when you hit rock bottom, truth is your only bargaining chip. Admitting you need help, it changes people's hearts. Aww. You're shit at negotiating, you know that, right? <laughs> but you are brutally honest. You might need that sort of honesty someday. Oh, Percy. Very well. Let's see where the truth takes us. They've always had chemistry. Aw, that makes me sad. They're really giving us all the feels <sighs> this season. I have goosebumps. Me too. Oh, yeah. Are you cold or you just have goosebumps? No, I have goosebumps from the scene. <laughs> I'm getting a lot of Percy backstory again, like season one. They probably felt like <laughs> they didn't talk about him too much in season two. Grief has become our most familiar neighbor. And yet the sorrow of this tragedy is somehow crueler than the rest. Oh As no! <sighs> so I just got goosebumps again. From us. This cannot be real. Like his family, Percival de Rose. No, no, no way! To his home and loyalty to its people. Oh my gosh. This is so sad. What? Percy stood tall. Reminding us that hope is a flame worth fostering. The Dawnfather oh. will keep his eternal spark alive in Holy all Holy shit. Us. I can't believe this is real. No <sighs> way. The campaign's going to be so sad. I know. I was just about to say that. Remember the light where the darkness dwells. My gosh, so sad. Unbelievable. No way. She didn't even get to say she loved him I back. Know. This does not feel real. Oh, what there's happened? him in there. Oh. Where's Percy? Oh, shit. Oh, that's so sad. Oh. <sighs> there's a reason I've been pressing you about this. I'm in love with you. Oh, shit. his arrow. I couldn't say it. I wasn't strong enough. You're the strongest person I know. I closed off my heart when I should have opened it. Percy never knew. Of course he did. He may have been an aloof, indignant <clears throat> asshole, and every time you gazed at him, I knew you'd be a fool to miss it. Uh. And that man was no fool. Gosh, that happened so fast. How can I live with that? How can anyone? <laughs> oh, he's gonna say his piece. Is Vex okay? He doesn't want to live in regret. Yeah. I'm sorry for running away. Oh, let's tell your feelings, Vax. But it's a future which hasn't yet been written. I'm, I'm starting to think fate is what you make it. Damn the feels. <laughs> Kiss. Yeah. Together. I don't want to be alone tonight. Do you? I haven't wanted. She to doesn't want to. Tonight. Yeah. Finally! Finally! Uh, Good job, Vax. I'm so, so sad. His classes. I know. Maybe Scanlan can do something. Or Pike. I could have stopped you from leaving. Why didn't you? When all options are terrible, 
you go with your heart. Oh. Kaylee's song. Oh. oh. Cuddling. <gasps> Matron of Dreamlands. We were I was just saying, when is she going to come back? Holy okay. shit. And Maybe she can do something about... Damn, that's creepy. Yeah, about um, Percy. I was wondering when he was going to feel like Percy's soul or something, right? No. <gasps> oh, shit. Do you Where have you to been? To offer condolences and plan our next move against Thordak. Oh, you've got some f nerve. Curse is getting worse. I hadn't planned on burdening you with this. Oh, but shit. it's time you knew the truth. What? what truth? Oh! Oh shit! They work together. What? Oh, she's a mess. We need to talk. You. Oh shit! What's all this? She looks like a mess. She's gonna leave? I need to clear my head. Drink it, and I will camp. Fix Alia. You can't. No. Their parents. The tales of destruction Thordak tells, boasting of the cities he's burned. By Rodan. <laughs> oh shit. That's where they're from. Your fate has been tethered to the Cinder King since you were a child. It's oh. time you stop ignoring it. Thordak is your destiny. What's going on? Yeah. Dozens what? of juvenile dragons wiped out Whitestone. And according to Raishan, Thordak's nest will hatch soon. If they do... We're fucked in every single <laughs> hole. Uh, yeah. We didn't listen to her last time and it got Percy killed. But taking him on for the most dangerous dragon in the world. Unless you have some army hidden away, what would be different? What army. If we did have an army. Oh yeah, boy. his people. Rog, I told you not to eat Percy's workshop paste. Well, no, I mean, <laughs> everywhere we've been, we made friends. Yeah, yeah. enemies. Oh, yeah, sure, but if Thordak wins, friends, enemies, they all suffer. Okay. Yeah. Rog's speaking facts. Yeah. We could ask Zara and Cash and Vasselheim. Oh and yeah. Break a groom. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah. They're bringing all the people back. Idea, Grog, that you're talking about a handful of scattered fighters. I doubt it would be enough. How Do about something. a thousand single soldiers? Hmm. Oh, is that her? Their family? That would certainly make a difference. Then what are we waiting for? The other elves. Yeah. Pyra. Pyra. <laughs> Damn. What Ooh. the heck? Assemble them. I haven't seen them for a minute. Mm -hmm. Oh, Percy. Oh. Oh, is that? Um. Yeah. yeah. Oh shit. Damn. <laughs> Cash. Cash and Zyra. Why do I have to be the bait, Z? Because my oh. Cash, you are just so damned attractive. <laughs> and how much will the take pay you for them? Mm -hmm. What if you upgrade it to something a bit scalier? Ha <laughs> you talking dragons? No, 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 no. Last time we got involved with you lot, we nearly got killed. Come on. All right, we know we owe you. But near death and certain death are quite different. <laughs> Sorry, me and Z, package deal. Speaking of, where's your sister? Oh, getting them. Yeah. We're going talking to every to location. <gasps> She's going to talk about her mom. Acquire the feathers bow. I suppose you've come to receive my praise. Lovely no. seeing you too, father. But no, I don't need approval. I've heard you're gathering forces, but I'm afraid that's quite impossible. Thordak can have him on for all I care. Our forces oh. must remain here in defense of Singorn. The scene is oddly Your quiet. Mm -hmm. is the easy part. Yeah. I want you to talk about the, the mom. Truth. The dragon yeah. killed mother, Elena. You blamed us for her death. Nonsense! I never said any such yeah. thing. You turned your back on your children. In our moment of need, you shut us out. The only advice you ever gave was to guard our hearts, to let no one in. And now I know why. It's because you were too proud to admit you loved her. Her death hurt you oh. as much as it hurt us. You taught me my love was poison. I learned the lesson so well. I kept the one decent man who shared his heart at arm's length until it was too late. Pixolia, I'm 
I'm sorry. Oh, this well. is my only bargaining chip. Yeah. If you've any love left for me, or for Mother, then march to Imon and prove it. Think of those who will occupy this world when you are gone. It's for literally your kids. <laughs> that scene was intense. Yeah. It's exactly what the dad needed to hear. And Laura Bailey's killing it. Great episode. Great dialogue so far. Cash and Zara declined our invitation. Oh. Will this be enough? I'm here. No matter what happens, we'll face it together. Together. <laughs> His hand. <gasps> oh, Kaylee? Kaylee. Oh, oh Pike. Spike. Oh, just nice voice. She does have a really nice voice. Oh, <laughs> she's so cute. This is Kaylee's song. Your lyrics oh. are beautiful, Scanlon. I tried being a father and a part of this team, and I failed at both things. Maybe there's a solution. Yeah, there is. No more distractions. Uh, guys, you gotta see this. Oh, the army. Seahorn. Nice. Let's go. She really did it. Yeah, let's go. She and her dad came too. Got a big ass army. I wonder what Raishan's gonna do this whole time too. Mm -hmm. Very well, our soldiers are at the ready. What is the plan of attack? While the ground forces engage Thordak's offspring, Vox Machina will use the destruction to reach his lair. We'll approach from the air. That won't work. Oh, oh let's go. there she is. And who might you be? She's um, well, a dragon. <laughs> He's gonna hate her. Yeah. There is an unprotected back entrance to Thordak's lair. And you assure us the tunnel will be open. I pledge my word. So, we take up the small ones while you use your vestiges on Thordak. It's a sound plan, Lady Vexari. Oh, He's being civil. Yeah. He's being a little bit more than civil now, finally. I didn't know that he loved his wife. Or loved his the mom, too. I had a feeling, but I, did, I thought something messy happened. Mm. That's why he was so bitter, you know? Ready, sister. Uh, doesn't feel right without Percy. For Percy. For Percy. For mother. For Damn. Alexandria. Sick. Damn, this is. I know. This is a big build up. Got all the chills. Uh, I keep getting goosebumps. I got goosebumps out too, shit. <laughs> I don't even get goosebumps like that. Smoke, but no fire. How's that work? And no resistance. Something bad's gonna I happen. Know. Too easy. Thankfully, we still have Raishan's entrance. I see it. What if she's double crossing them? Hopefully not. Ah, I feel like a lot of people are gonna die. I see a dragon there. Yeah. Oh shit. There's a lot. They're what halting. What are they doing? This is a trap. Yeah. Why are they not attacking? <gasps> oh my god. What oh is no, it? it's all gonna crumble. No. She sold us out. <gasps> oh, you're so right. Still hot. Thordek must have melted it shut less than an hour ago. Gross. Oh, Can you punch through this? But it won't be quiet. You think she sold them out or That's he just what knew? She said. I'm stronger than I thought. <laughs> Don't think that's you, big guy. Or maybe it's part of the plan. I told yeah. you we couldn't trust her. What? Oh, oh what the hell? he's right there. Oh shit. Holy shit. Oh no, it's just gonna be a massacre. Oh no, he's gonna light them all on fire. Oh, oh shit. Oh <gasps> is the dad gonna oh, die? This is insane. What have I done? Shit. Does it end like that? Ah, oh. That didn't even feel like the whole episode. What the f Why did that feel so fast? Man, the last episode was all feels, but this was even more feels. I think this one was the most... That was like the most sad episode out of all, all, all of Vox, Vox so Machina. far, right? They really took a huge loss, right? As a group. And like, you don't know how they're going to bounce back from that and i actually thought that vex was just gonna completely lose it yeah and i feel like her how she was able to pick herself back up 
was when Vax came to her and told her like, hey, you know, this is the this is actually what happened to mom, yeah. you know, or to their mom. And so when she talks to her father and like they have that that moment where she, they're able to finally like quash or put things aside and realize like, hey, you you loved our mom, mm -hmm. you know, and I am so regretful because she didn't get to tell her real feelings to Percy yeah. and it's because of the dad. And I, th I think that's like the whole point of this whole episode, right? This is a very like Vex heavy episode. Yeah. And it's her living in regret and her <sighs> facing um, all of her, her deep down issues that she got from her family. Yeah. And um, this was just like a, a heavy, heavy Vex Laura Bailey episode. She yeah. had a very good... Such good dialogue. She had very good dialogue and moments with Vax, with mm -hmm. her father, even with just her crying next to Percy's casket, which is so yeah. sad. But I think the whole point is her living regret, not not telling Percy how she feels because her father taught her to be like that. And that's yeah, how the, stone cold. And that's how the father is because he never wanted to admit that he loved the mother and he blamed, um, he kind of blamed his, his kids for the, the reason why dead. she died she died yeah we, we saw her a little bit unclear exactly what that story is and what's going on and we don't really know the full extent of what Rashawn really told um Vax but, it's funny because I felt like this episode went by like this like really yeah, really fast for sure because there was so many scenes into it I almost forgot that the whole funeral scene of Percy was at the beginning mm -hmm. and then the middle part was everyone all of Vox Machina going out to different regions and assembling a whole army to right. fight Thordak. And then the final scene was going to Thordak's lair and, or not going, yeah, the Vox going to Thordak's lair and then the rest of the group um, basically getting ready to fight against Thordak's children. But then Thordak ended up showing up there. Yeah. Right? So it seems like a trap from Raishan. Yeah. We don't really know. Maybe it maybe she's making it seem like it's a setup and maybe she's helping them out in the end. Yeah, or maybe she didn't she Or she just didn't know. Yeah, or she didn't know that Thordak know. was going to do that. I mean it would make sense, right? Because Thordak should be super paranoid right now. Yeah. So he probably is looking for all these other loose ends um to make sure that, you know, things go the way he's planning it. Yeah. But yeah, we don't know. Yeah. Uh, a, this was tough. a very emotional episode mixed in with a, kind of like a very built up episode that like yeah. they were setting up a lot right uh probably for the third episode i think Oof. it's gonna be some kind of it's getting crazy ongoing or not ongoing some a big a big fight scene yeah i, I would everyone. think so i think it's or maybe just a huge battle. loss another huge loss oh shit so it seems yeah. like everyone was gonna get demolished by Thor. <laughs> oh shit yeah vax and vex's dad is gonna die for sure for sure i don't know he looked like he was gonna get roasted i don't know yeah, yeah we'll see yeah right. heavy episode Heavy, heavy episode, but really, really amazing writing and mm -hmm. um, amazing, like, emotional ties to this episode. So, yeah. yeah. All, right, All right, guys. We'll see you in the next one. See you in episode nine. Episode nine? Yeah.